seven o'clock, I'm Jade Smith. And I'm Rob Sexual. The headlines. Wakey quakey. Many bailers were shaking out of bed this morning at 1am by an earthquake measuring 5.3 on the Richter scale, the highest in 25 years in England. One man hurt his pelvis. The local community is in shock after the usually placid and friendly student Mark Jewell ruthlessly sighed down a journalist colleague during a game of football. Paul the Shark Garbutt was left hospitalised by the horror tackle, however his x-ray proved confusing. Model student Jewell expressed regret over the incident. He said, I also hurt my neck. Many bailers will appreciate the words builders, noise and disturbance. But what about the surrounding wildlife? Rob is at what was once a hub of wildlife with this report. Thank you, Jade. I'm here at Encliffe Vale Pond, where residents have often been able to look out of their window onto the green pastures and admire a pond which has brought warmth to many students' hearts. Unfortunately, this water feature only brings desolation and solitude. Unfortunately, the warmth that was felt by some students has now been replaced by an icy chill. One resident, Ali Johnson, had this to say. I had imagined a tropical wilderness. Instead, I have found myself in an environmental toilet. I thought I would be living amongst wildlife and would be able to go for a swim in the morning, petting them gracefully. Unfortunately, the only petting that students will be doing around here is of tramps and raw sewage. Students are more likely to get cholera than enjoyment out of their local pond. I've been Rob Setchell reporting for Vale News. Now back to you in the studio, Jade. Thanks, Rob. Now, business news. The largest sum of money in the business world today was the top and tape me. And finally, Encliffe Vale is aiming to make history as local puzzle fiends, Strat 7, affectionately known as the Womb, have begun the biggest crossword of all time, comprising of over 30,000 clues. Vale News recorded this exclusive interview earlier. Here I am in Flat 7 with local musician James Blacker. James, what do you have to say about your exciting new plans? This is a big crossword. Uh, 4,675 down, 1959, a Broadway musical. Sound <laughs> of music. Yes! Yes!